Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Tuesday morning, 30 minutes to go until that opening bell. And just like we have recently, we'll start it off in positive territory. S&P is positive by 10 points right now, trading at 3,064. NASDAQ futures positive by 10 points as well, 96.04. Dow futures up 104 at 25,567. You've got oil up a bit, up 56 cents at 36 flat. You got the 10-year yield at 0.67% and the gold contract flat at 1749. We'll start things off. We'll start it off with a chart of the S&P. You see the highs overnight. 3,075. We've pulled back just a bit. These are 15 minute bars. A little bit of a sell off in the last 15 minutes from 3,068. We're now trading at 3,064. You see the acceleration higher begin at just about 11 o'clock. We were trading at 3,035. For some context of where we are, how about that run from 3,397 to 2,174? We're currently trading 3,064. NASDAQ almost getting it all back. You have the NASDAQ futures, NASDAQ 100 up 16 points right now at 96.11. We've seen a little, and that's, I mean, look how close we are, 150 points away from where we were. And we actually hit a high, I mean, a little bit of a sell-off in the NASDAQ, as you see. NASDAQ was up at 96.70. We've sold off about 60 points. We're trading right now at 96.12. And you're looking at a NASDAQ that's barely in the positive. Well, right now you have S&P futures up about three-tenths percent. You have the Dow futures up four-tenths percent. And even the Russell where are we? I thought I had it. Russell positive as well. RTY, yes, up 11 points, about 8 tenths percent for the Russell. Start things off, let's jump over the charts and we'll pull up. There we go, the Dow 30. As I mentioned, there was yesterday action. There was the midnight action that the run starts higher, 25,584. We'll jump over to commodities, crude oil, $36. We were about 50 cents higher at 36.50 at about 5.45 a.m. this morning. Gold contract holding steady at 17.50, quite a price tag for the price of gold, and that euro US dollar at 111.67. In terms of other action out there, Dick Sporting Goods out with their numbers today, missing a bit, but talking about things maybe accelerating already back to normal, not normal. Let me get the quote since I put that. You're talking about stocks making moves in the top one. So Dick's e-commerce sales surged 110% during the quarter, and the retailer added that the current quarter has gotten off to a strong start. There's Dick's. There's the volatility from 36.46 to 37.16. And after the bell tonight, we got Zoom earnings, and they're Zooming already up to 211.70. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pezzavento, great program. Trade what you see. Coming up live right now for the market open. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Live programming all day till 4 o'clock. We'll be right back.